So we got iPhone 5 news. A lot of people have been waiting for this phone, especially the Apple fans. And I gotta say, this phone shares a lot of similar features to the other phones on the market. I'm not gonna knock Apple that much, but I will say this. Two of the best features on the iPhone 5 is 4G LTE and also the A6 chip that was created by Samsung. For all the people who were expecting this amazing phone with all this innovation, all these different features, it is resembling a lot of the same features that these other manufacturers have already implemented. This is why Apple wanted to ban all these products. It makes a lot of sense now. If they have their competition using all these features, obviously they just want to be the one company to have them. You start to think about what they're trying to do, and I noticed one change they made to the charging feature on the phone. I think they were calling it Thunderbolt and Lightning. You know, the innovation that's going on in Apple is at a little bit of a standstill, so I'm not sure if people were expecting like this unique device. They increased the size of the screen, so they stretched it out a bit. I noticed that happened with the Galaxy S3 already. Again, I'm not trying to knock them that much. It's just that there's not that many innovative things coming from them. Other than that, the price point is the same as the 4S when they came out, so you could spend a couple hundred dollars and get yourself a 16 gigabyte version of the phone. They drop down the cost of the 4S to $99. What they're gonna do is they're gonna be playing catch up. All the other manufacturers are just gonna keep going forward and advancing with the phones. Now, for you Apple fans who have been coming to my videos and trying to argue with me about these facts, about the patterns, about the features of you in this phone, if you want to debate about it, it's not debatable. So if you compare this phone, the iPhone 5, with the other Android devices that have already been created, you could do your own research and you could figure it out. If you want to comment on my video and you want to start arguing and you want to start, you know, saying a bunch of random shit, if it's not true, you're going to be called out. If it's not me, it's going to be somebody else who subscribed to my channel. So just research your facts if you have a problem with what we're saying on this channel. And also, if um, you do agree, by all means, post your comments. So you guys tell me, what do you think of the iPhone 5? Do you think it's an innovative success? Or do you think it's just a regurgitation of what's already been out there on the market? Let me know in the comments below. And I will say this, because they're celebrating the new iPhone. Fuck Apple and fuck off. I'll see you guys later. Cheers.